my name's Brian Scoyles and welcome to this video in a sequence on advanced floater fishing. In the earlier ones we've covered bait, we've had a look at the fishery and we've had a look at the tackle and tactics. So now let's just have a bit of fun and see if we can catch some fish. Here we go, nice little mirror coming to the end of our flow today. Um, it's actually been quite tricky, the fishing side of things, but this one came from a free-lined mixer, literally lowered off the rod end after about probably an hour of feeding. Um, got them moving out of the pads, got them feeding right under our feet, just lowered a mixer down and this one came up, opened its mouth, sucked it in and jobs were good. Excellent day, really enjoyed it. Learned lots about different types of uh, surface fishing from stalking in the edge to fishing at range. Baits and tactics, a bit like normal carp fishing yeah. as I call it. There yeah. are a million and one ways to catch them on the bottom and there's just as many ways off the top as well. Really yeah. enjoyed it, I think the lads have as well, yeah. Brian. Yeah. Fantastic. Okay, say goodbye to Jules. <laughs> goodbye. Hopefully fishing doesn't get any simpler than this. We've got a little size 12 mixer hook with a small pellet band tied to it. We've pre-drilled a biscuit. And we have just pulled the band onto there where it will grip the pellet. And if things go to plan, we're gonna turn around and lower this down to a fish and it's gonna suck it in and hopefully I'm gonna strike and hook it. Let's see if we can actually do that. So here it comes, it's coming out of the pads now. So with a bit of luck, if it's getting confident, it'll come out into open water. And there it is, I can see it now, just in the weeds, just to the side. Come on, you know you want them, there it is. Still looking to me, just a little bit nervous. Mm. That one just took really confident, just to the left. Um, and it's still taking quite confidently, but it's not just quite coming where it's perfect for me to present a bait, so let's not rush things. Let's just keep dropping one or two in there. Just get myself exactly in the right place for this. Just check the clutch, tight but not over tight. There's a fish shaking those stems and pads like mad, but they're not quite coming out just into open water at this moment in time. I think what I need to do is just get a bait in there though, just to, uh, so that when a fish comes up, it's ready, to, I'm in position. Just a fraction short that cast or swing. Bring that back. Oh, a bit too much. I 
That's nice. I missed that so badly that we haven't even spooked the fish. We can have another go at that. Well, perhaps not have a go at that. We'll try and do it properly this time. After a bit of a, a quick move, Brian's been prepping a swim for us and uh, no joking, within 10 minutes um, we've had this one out free lined. But one of the things I'd like to mention is um, we're actually using uh, a size 12 barbless hook and it just goes to show we've given these fish quite a, a bit of welly to get them out of the weed but that size 12 hook really did hold and it just goes to show you haven't got to go big hooks, the small ones are just as effective. Yeah nice bit of angling. Um, well impressed with that and as you say it's like five minutes in the right place bit of prepping before that mm. uh, and that fish was caught probably what less than a meter from the bank yeah um nothing on the end other than a size 12 barbless and uh, and i must say there's nothing nothing more pure in pure. fishing when no, you can actually no. watch it take your hook bait yeah, that is fantastic fantastic fishing finish off our day on Alderfen. Um, we've potted around on the uh, the middle lake and uh, had several chances. Alfie's had a, a, a cracking scaly mirror. Um, I've had uh, a smaller mirror and managed to muck up another one and uh, just to finish just to show you the potential for the water we've now moved on to gate pool which is the uh, heavily stocked um, easier pool and we've just fed for a few minutes and now we're just going to do exactly the same again. Lower a free line biscuit in and see if we can finish the day with a fish just off the rod top in this pool. Thing, yep, just Yeah, 
It's just good fun, isn't it? Just a nice way to end the day, just... Lovely. We got that. And that's me done for the day. Time to put this one back, pack up and go home. Time for some tea. <laughs>